Hey, what's up, guys? We're playing some more Sly. We're gonna go ahead and start episode five. I think once again we're gonna be kind of fighting against Contessa, which is gross because I hate spiders. But Time hey, for a let's do this. Payback. The Contessa, having escaped us in the prison, is now hiding out in her castle estate. It's a well-fortified Gothic nightmare that would make any thief run in terror. Terrible or not, that's where we're headed. To sweeten the deal, we've learned that the Contessa, who until recently was a secret member of the Claw Gang, is in possession of the Clockwork Eyes. The Thievius Raccoonus describes the eyes stopping opponents dead in their tracks, transfixed in their gaze. It doesn't take a genius to figure out what an accomplished hypnotist could do with such powerful artifacts. News of the Contessa's corruption has spread to Interpol. Constable Neela, being closest to the case, was granted a cash allowance to hire an army of local mercenaries. It looks like we're walking into a full-scale war. But we have to act now, before things go from bad to worse. So that's weird, right? Because Neela... Well, okay, so we're presuming that Neela and Contessa are both in the Claw Gang, considering Neela betrayed us to give her to the Contessa. I'm just assuming Neela's also in the Claw Gang. I would assume, right? But I don't. I guess I don't know, considering now they're fighting. All right, let's um jump over to the Thief Net. We can buy all these moves because we've just got that money on us. Self Extractor, capture, oh, and extract medicine from them. Okay. Use while jumping to create a wall of flames on impact. Okay. Ooh, okay. Paraglide. Now that one is a good move to have right about now let's go ahead and definitely stick that up so oh, let's see but a lot of these are all of these moves are so useful now oh we don't while jumping okay we actually don't need to set that to a button we just do this and we have the paraglider dude that's okay i'm so happy we finally got the paraglider and funny enough as a kid th i think this is the level that i despised the most i remember this specific level as the one that i did not like because there's just like tanks everywhere oh and now we have to find all the bottles too so i think i'm gonna do this one a little differently let's do a couple one or two missions and then we'll go find the bottles let's go ahead and do it okay here's the plan first take some recon photos around the area then make your way up to the Re-education tower. Looks pleasant enough. Oh, and stay clear of tanks. You know, so you don't get blown up into little sticky pieces. You say stinky or sticky? I mean, I guess neither one is particularly good, but... Alright, so I'm going to do exactly what he did not say, and I'm going to go ahead and head up in here. How do you get up on there? So I'm just taking a picture of it. Okay, the there's the boat. The has these boats out on patrol against Nayla's army. They could be useful to hitch a ride. Okay. Oh, that's a tank. My bad. See, this level has just stuff everywhere. Oh, am I supposed to just take a pick? Okay, there's the door, Bentley. Wow. Yeah, that door looks... That door looks crazy for sure. Alright. What other stupid things do I have to take a picture of? Okay. Yes, okay, that's how we get over here. Alright. Oh, I'm gonna get blasted. Psych. No! No! There's so many lasers everywhere, dude. I'm trash at this. Alright, where's the picks that I gotta take? Okay, they're over here. I'm gonna kill this guy. Oh no. Stop following. Alright, how do I take a pic of you, huh? Camera, please! Okay. There we go. That's a solid picture, by the way. I should become a photographer. Alright, let's get out of its way! 
Yeah, let's jump on the van here. Oh, this was probably where I, was uh, where I was supposed to take the picture from. But I took the harder route of staying on the ground and doing it. Alright, where's the last pick, huh? Over there? Oh, the blimp. I could probably take a blip picture of the blimp from anywhere. Whoops, did not take a picture there. Blimp. There's not many blimps in real life. I saw like a Reddit post where it was like, how many blimps are there in total? And there's not many left in the world. Okay. Like, I, th I think there are... There's a difference between a Zeppelin and a Blimp. They're different. <clears throat> and I forgot which one there's a couple of and which one there's not. A or which one has less. Which one's rarer, a Blimp? Or a Zeppelin? Okay. Let's try to get up somewhere high. And then we can kind of use our binoculars to see where we're even supposed to be heading off to here. We might as well grab a few bottles while we're at it, huh? <gasps> why did you not grab? I pressed zero. I don't know why you didn't grab. Alright, let's try this one more time. Hopefully without falling off the edge of a... Okay, you ready? There you go, Sly. Nope, I do not feel like falling off this building right now. Yo, how high does this thing go? Oh, jeez. Dude, we could fly far with from here. Okay. Well, maybe we can fly all the way up to our mission. Oh. Is this the way we're supposed to go? Okay. Yes, yeah, fly behind this dude. Hopefully he just won't see us. You can't see me. I'm behind a barrel. Let's go to sleep. I definitely want his loot, so... Thank you, bud. Appreciate it. Really? A bronze medal? That's all you have on you? Alright, well, you deserve to die for that one. <clears throat> Did I hear a bottle? I... I'm gonna go grab it. There's no reason for me not to just go grab it really quickly. Whoopsies. Sorry about that, bud. I didn't mean to wake you. Okay, so I need to get up. Get up here. Alright. Is there a bottle all the way at the top? Nah, oh, this, this would have been a really good place to put a bottle right there. But there is another one. I'm just trying not to... No! Oh, 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 I guess, oh, I got so lucky that I didn't just, like, fall all the way to the bottom. You know what? I'll, I'll take that as a little bit of mercy for me. I definitely should have just fell off the whole building right there for being dumb. You'll love, absolutely love to see it. Don't do that, that's weird. Bentley, there's more than just the clockwork eyes up here. Why are you doing this? Mila, she set me up. I'm an honest cop. Of course you are. I've read your psychological profile. I know that you're honest. Then why are you doing this to me? Because, dear, you're honest. You see, by chasing after Sly Cooper, you learned too much about the claw gun and its spice operation. It was only a matter of time before you figured out that I was a secret member. So, when Mila gave me a chance to put you in custody, I took it. Coward! You're a disgrace to Interpol! I'll make it my life's work to destroy you! Oh, I'm afraid your life, let alone your life's work, isn't going to last much longer. Once I integrate the clockwork eyes into this device, your life's work will be whatever I tell you. I won't be brainwashed that easily. Quite right. It won't be easy. Or painless. But I will reprogram your mind, and you will take the fall for me at Interpol. Now, just lay back and relax. Go to your happy place. And stay there forever. 
I don't think they've seen you. Take a few photos and get out of there. No. I've got to help Carmelita. She's in trouble here. There's nothing you can do now. Get the recon photos and come back to the safe house. I swear, we'll find a way to help her. All right. First thing, eyes. The clockwork eyes. They seem to be routed through that control board. Get a shot of the console so I can decipher its make. Also, just putting it out there, dude. The developers definitely use some creativity with Carmelita. That's all I'm gonna say. It was free for them not to do that. All right, what are we taking up next? Shadow Guard. They look very elite. Tough is too sissy a word to describe those guys. Kind of look the same as anyone else, but sure. That's that's a mind shuffler. I didn't think they were real. It's made what? of equal parts science and black magic. Indestructible to conventional weapons. Come on, bro. Man's geeking out over a. Mind shuffler. Right, where in the world is this old terminal? Old terminal? Oh, this thing, right? Yeah. That old terminal should be hardwired to the systems in this tower. We need to find a way to get it online. All right, head back to the safe house and we'll get a plan together. All right, sorry, Carmelita. We'll come back. Hopefully your mind isn't goo by the time we get to you, but hey. The war between Neela and the Contessa has put the castle on high alert. To get at the clockwork eyes, we'll need to subtly manipulate this conflict to our advantage. Here's the plan. Murray, sneak into the castle and kidnap the head of security. I want to ask him a few questions. Meanwhile, Sly and I are going to get a little paranormal. I'll slip into the crypts beneath the castle and put together a bad mojo bomb. It should be enough to destroy the mind shuffler. Sly, you capture a few local ghosts and drop them into Neela's headquarters. Hopefully the near-death experience will inspire her to purchase more mercenary firepower. We've all got our assignment. Good luck. We just gotta go get ghosts. I mean, of course. What else would we do? We just go get some ghosts. Okay, let's see. So, do we got a mission for each of us? Okay. Well, we're gonna go ahead and do ghost capture first. Just because that one intrigues me the most. We just gotta go get ghosts. I'm gonna get shot. Psych. Oh, I, I actually almost slipped on that one. Get out of my way, please. Okay, and once again, let's make sure to grab as many bottles as we can while running around. See, can I... Can I jump to that one from here? Right? Yeah. Let's go and grab that bottle and then we'll head to the mission. Right, let's try to get everything the hard way. Like, jumping from a weird legend trying to smack it instead of just... How do I have eight already? What? Okay. Gotta go crippin'. The coffin of the evil wolf priestess. Sounds pretty harsh. Does the old girl really deserve that sort of treatment? Weren't you listening? She was an evil wolf priestess. Once you smash the coffin, it'll free all the ghosts trapped in there with her. Okay, I don't know where you're going with all of this, but freeing trapped ghosts sounds vaguely heroic. Yeah, I know about this one, Bentley. Sounds like he's doing a little too much here. But, I can steal some things, so I will definitely do that first before I release any spooks out. Silver metal? Alright. I will, I will only kill you by sending you into the water instead of beating up with my cane. Alright, be free! Oh, I actually gotta go in. I don't wanna go in. Yeah. Bro, for real? Oh, we you crippin'? Okay, well, this is fine. We're fine. Zoom, 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 zoom. There we go. Got some money in you. 
Okay. Can I hit you into the fire? <laughs> Alright, we'll do that then. Yeah, he's got money in his pocket. I kind of want it. I'm gonna try to get. It. I'm gonna try to get what's in his pocket. This is like a little too much. Oh. Dude, is he gonna just jump back in his coffin? Oh, he's just gonna go to sleep. Okay. Well, I want what's in. Oh, I did all that for a bronze medal. Oh, I feel ashamed. You're gonna die now. All right, ghosts, be free. You've been spooked. Nice work. Now head outside, and I'll fill you in on phase two. Now we gotta catch them. Do some Ghostbusters. in your Badakukon to capture ghosts. Didn't I just set these guys free? Why would I want to capture them again? Not to worry. It's only a short-term confinement. Gather all the ghosts, then set them free down the chimney of Thela's headquarters. I get you. She'll think it's a sneak attack from the Contessa. Correct. If I did my math right, and I always do my math right, Thela should respond to the assault by purchasing more firepower. Anything bad for the Contessa is good for us. And we get to really freak out Neela. Okay. I capture them with my... With my... With a photo? Okay, that is a super weird way to capture a ghost. I don't know how they're... Do I have like a special hard drive or something? How How is it stored? What kind of <laughs> what kind of daddy data are we running here, huh? Right, let's go grab this bottle while we're at it. It's actually kind of a good mission because it, it lets me roam a little bit more than usual. I made a mistake. Just kidding. I see another bottle over there that I want to go grab after I steal whatever's in this dude's pocket. Zoink, zoink, gimme, gimme. All for real. Gold pocket watch. Okay. I'm gonna kill him just because I don't feel like dealing with him in a minute. Oh, and he gets me a little bit more mana. Okay. And there's another bottle down there which I'll for sure grab. Is there another bottle? No. Let's keep going up. Let's make sure there's no other bottles in this vicinity. Okay, I think this is... Yeah, this is how we got up here. I think we got the bottle that was over here. Let's go ahead and, um... Jump on here to grab this bottle. Gonna get this ghost. Trap him in our... Spooky hard drive. I hear another bottle. But how do I get up there? That's the real question. Alright, I'm just gonna throw you off the roof because that makes... Oh, there's another bottle. Okay, we gotta make make sure to go get that one too. Man, um, okay, I guess we'll wait for him. Or if he wants to turn around, that would be real nice of him too. go let's grab that really let's grab that let's make our way over here can I capture this ghost in this area you good where you at bud ah there you are you've been caught okay Where are we going now? The one thing that I do like about this map is you can go really high, and I'm a sucker for going to high places. I think I'm still a 12 year old at heart. The higher I go, the happier I am. Right, where was that ghost? Oh, 
there was one. Let's go ahead and try to get around a little bit here. Just want to make sure I don't fall off on accident either. I should probably kill this guy in case he runs around. <gasps> there's there's our um treasure. I don't think I can get that right now because I can't run back to the headquarters. There you are, bud. Okay, are you gonna go around? If you go around, can I snap a pic of you real quick? Thank you. Okay, there's another one over there. I don't know why he fell off there, but did a bat push me? I think a bat pushed me there. That was actually kind of funny. Wait, there's a bottle there. I want to grab that. Can I jump over this? I can't jump over it. Okay, good. Get out of me way. Oh, hey, what up? Dang it. Don't go inside of the building. Someone's in there. Very rude of you, ghost. Also, I don't- I can't tell what animal that is. I don't know if it's some, like, weird... turtle bird? I can't really tell. Oh, you have some in your pocket. Also, I almost just ran into him. Like an absolute genius. Gold medal. Alright, you love to see it. I love gold medals. I haven't- I've only gotten a- I haven't gotten a lot of bronze, which makes me real happy. Alright, another bottle up there. Let's go ahead and zoink that one. Oh, show. Oh, what up? You're in a prime spot for a pig. Oh, I only caught, like, his legs there, but... The game seems to be satisfied. Also, there are nine... We should really grab those guys, because we're going to have to come back here anyway. That is what I'm looking for. Come here, bottle. Alright, let's keep ghost hunting here. Did this guy really chase me all the way down here? Chase me all the way down here just to get smacked. Whoopsies. Oh, hey, thanks for leading me to a bottle. Do I hear another bottle? No, I don't think that's another bottle. That'd be nuts. There's another timer thing. Okay, so we know where two of them are now. You have something special for me? Looks like you do. Another gold medal. See, we haven't been hitting the bronze stuff very often. Which is nice. Okay. Where'd you go, bud? There you are. Right, I got you, you flying turtle. Alright, two more. Ooh, I can snap this one right out of the air. I just need to want to go back high again. Okay, we can grab the pick from up here real easily. Clean. Alright, last one. And we could probably even paraglide all the way there, which is kind of sick. Maybe. Maybe it'll let us paraglide all the way. Is there... No, I can't get any higher. Um... want to get somewhere, like, super high. Can I get anywhere? Okay, okay. I'll be happy with what I got. Let's go ahead and paraglide that over here. Now, where is this last ghost? <gasps> no! That is not what I meant to grab. Where's this last ghost? It's over here, there, right? Okay. Let's see if we can paraglide all the way there. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, we... <gasps> There's... This is the other... You know what? I can... Let me... <sighs> really? Alright. Let's say let's grab it, and then when we finish the mission, we can just kind of bring it back, but... Never mind, the game does not want me to do that. Don't get shot, don't get shot. I think I hear a bottle. He really shot me out of the air. Okay, right here. No! Ah. Uh, Okay, somehow we got them from the camera into a lamp post or a lantern. Okay. So the 
Contessa wants war, eh? Perhaps it's time I purchase a little air power. A few bombers should put that old charlatan in her place. Love me some planes. As long as they don't like try to snipe me out of the air. Alright, how do we get there? So we go from oh okay, that's easy. So we go from here. Just do a little little paraglide there. We jump and grab that one. 20 out of 30 with just a couple of missions. Okay. Well, let's definitely keep looking. I have a feeling there's going to be one in here. Yeah, the only bad part about looking for bottles this way compared to how I usually do it is what how I usually do it is I go section by section in the map and I kind of know which places I cleared. The way I'm doing it now, I'm just running around and finding them and I'm finding them. But this way, there's no really way for me to judge which places I've looked at extensively and which ones I haven't. So, now I kind of have to run, rerun around and kind of check everywhere because I'm not really sure where I have and haven't looked. And I say that, which I technically do know where I have and haven't looked, but not as detailed as I usually do it. Because if you guys... Well, I guess I edit it. I edit a lot of it out, but I tend to find all 30 fairly quickly with the method that I usually use. So definitely now it's going to take me slightly longer to find them all, but it shouldn't take that long still. But I think we're at 31. Let me try to find the rest of the bottles here. I, I think I can kind of devote the rest of this episode to bottles, and then next episode we'll go ahead and continue with the missions. Okay, so there's a lot of places, like, up high that I need to check. Hello? But I will be grabbing whatever's in your pocket, sir. Silver metal. Okay, not bronze. We take those. There's one bottle. Okay, that's 23. I hear... Okay, never mind. 24. Check, I should definitely check this area. Yes, see, this place I haven't checked much. So likely I was going to find a few bottles. Now I wouldn't be surprised if there was also a bottle on the floor around here. Yeah. I mean, again, the game doesn't particularly make it hard, but if you use your brain a little bit, you can kind of guess where a lot of things are. Like, there's obviously going to be one, at least one bottle... In this small little area, you know? And it's like, well, there's nowhere really you can go. It has to be on the floor. And sure, lo and behold, there's one on the floor. There's, it's the only place it could be, so. But now, that that logic gets a little harder and harder as you get less bottles. Because now, all of a sudden, the bottle could be just about anywhere. Okay, let's go ahead and grab this. Let's get... Ooh, 50 seconds. Okay, they're making it a little harder now. You absolutely love to see it. Although it's still not very hard, because you just fly right on over. Man, if I could grab this one while I was at it and just, like, double fist treasure, I would definitely do that. But I also have to make sure I don't get sniped by a tank right here. Also, I hear a bottle. I don't know how I missed one so close to the base, but I did. Okay. Let's return this one. Let's find the bottle that's right here. I have missed it. Is it on the ledge? I bet you that's right on the other edge of this, right? No, oh, it's not. But on top? No? Yo. This place got me flabbergast. Flabbergasted? Is that the right word? Oh, it's in the sewer. Okay. Now, I have no idea how to get into the sewer, so that's a little bit of a problem. Did they actually make one that's actually harder to find? How do I... I wonder, can I only... No, I was gonna say, can I get to that at a later point in the game? But, that's they've never done that before. They've never hid a bottles out of sight using a story, so... Now, this makes me wonder... 
how many more bottles are in these like caverns clearly not too many but where is this supposed to take me oh I see what the deal is that's not where I wanted to go but all right Here. Ew. I think that might just hit it. Okay. But we're actually going to continue. We're going to grab this, last two bottles, and then do a mission next episode, guys. Thanks for watching.